This example will show us how easy it is to add symmetry to our sketches. Now what we intend to do is actually add a slot in this particular area here that you can see highlighted. So I'm going to uh, just start my sketch and we're just going to drop a, a slot in approximately about there and we'll add in the relevant values. So I'd like to make that 120 millimeters and we want a width of 15 millimeters. Now I also want to add a dimension from this edge here to the arc of our slot. Now if I select it by default it always goes to the centre. If we want to get round that what we can do is again if we add our dimension but this time from the edge if we hold down the shift key and select the arc again you'll see that it does indeed go to the actual edge of the arc rather than the centre. So we're just going to add that at 25 millimetres. Right. Now what I'd like to do is to actually cut this uh, slot through, so we're just going to do a through all cut as such. Now the intention as I said earlier on was to add symmetry. Now if we look at this particular uh, component here, and all I need to do is actually increase this particular slot. So if I increase this from 80, now you can see the slot stays in the same position. What I'd like to do is position this so it's always symmetrical about the two edges. So let's just go back to making that 80 millimeters as we had before. And let's actually just go back into our sketch and actually add the relevant relations. Now what I can do is if I go to my sketch relations just by adding a relation. And what I'd like to do is select the actual edge of our original geometry the center line of our slot and we'll just add the top edge you can see they have this option of symmetry and that's now positioned that accordingly now let's have a look at the results of that if I now go back and I change the value of my opening just by dragging it you can see that the slot indeed does move